Okay, so I will be doing a review on the Caterpillar 374DL. So, that's it on my first gear Kenworth T880, third axle. It's a little big on it, but I mean, it fits. Of course, you need outriggers. You know? Show it next to this. That's it next to the 336 DL. Over there. So, it's good detail. Sorry about the lighting. So, these are metal. This, that handrail, that one, and these over here for some reason it transitions from pl metal to plastic. It's weird. Mirror's plastic but silver background. Got some nice steps there. This is etched in. So is up here. Um a nice exhaust stack. Very nice. Cow guard. With some nice interior detail. The door does not open though. And so nice hydraulic lines right here. Black to yellow to black. And then some right there. Very big bucket though. You can't curl in all the way it heads it. Because, see? You know, you can only have the bucket that much curled all the way in. But, so, digging that. You could modify it to make it go all the way down, but that's it. That's like an inch, if that. But, great model overall. That just looks great. The other side, that's metal too. Handrail right there. But, retractable tracks. So. Well, they spring in and out. The bucket's just... Those teeth are just insane. But good wear plating detail on the back. Good curl. Good dump. They could have painted those rivets though. I mean, like, come on. But it is etched through there. You can see through. But underside, nothing special at all. Give you another look at it on the low boy. But I would definitely recommend getting this T eighty if you don't have one yet. I'm taking this with my phone this video. But whatever. And next to 336, quite a bit size compares. It's a little, just a little bit bigger, you know. Oh. 336 bucket literally fits inside of that. Yeah. So, it's a big bucket. Alright, that's all.